So this is where a year in the life of the sweet potato really starts. I started the first year that NC State had the micropropagation unit, I think it was 1998. And I've been doing it that way ever since. We're in one of our greenhouses where we start our micropropagation sweet potato plant process. We start out with mother plants from NC State. We get them by little plants. Then we grow them out in about three weeks or so. It's long enough that we can do these cuttings here. And we just keep doing that process from the end of January to about the middle of March till we fill up our greenhouse space. We just keep planting and multiplying and multiplying so we get a ton of plants off of one mother plant. We'll take those cuttings directly straight to the field and plant to produce our G1 seed that we're going to use and we'll sell to other growers to use across the country. We're in one of our other propagation houses. We moved from the gutter system to on ground, on ground growing with new pot and soil put in every year. We're cutting these plants today to plant outside in the fields. We want the plants cut the same length so they'll go in the ground the same length. So it's a whole lot of a whole lot of hands on and a lot of a lot of people got to be involved to get this done. No telling how many million plants we're gonna cut off of all these plants this year to, uh, to produce all new clean seed stock. You don't always got to have soil to grow sweet potato plants in. It's what I call aeroponics. It's got mist nozzles down here that's on timers that spray every eight minutes for six seconds, 24 hours a day. We got grow lights in here, the red and blue grow lights. And it's amazing you can take this little two node cutting, stick it into where your bottom node is at the bottom where the water can hit it and in two days you'll have roots coming and it'll fill this whole gutter up with a root mass. They actually seem to grow a little faster than they do in the pot and soil. It's easy, it's a good working level. You don't have to buy pot and soil. It's easy clean out. It produces a lot of plants pretty quick. 